For section A, we are building a snowmobile. No, wait. You're making two different snowmobiles. This is a technique I really like for Lego League. Often you have a group of six or more students, and when building a single model, there just isn't enough for everyone to do something, you know? Building multiple copies keeps everyone busy, but doesn't yield additional learning opportunities. If you have the resources, students can build similar but unique models. Then they can compare and contrast them. Which works better? Why? This knowledge will be helpful for the students when they begin to prototype their own designs later. So I'll build two models of the snowmobile. I built the first one. And let me show you how it moves. For me, that moved really slowly. I was a little disappointed. Did yours behave the same way? It could be that I had batteries that were running a little bit low, or I didn't attach something quite right. I also only had one rubber band, so I had to kind of improvise for the second one, and that might have affected my results. But um, how did yours do? Well, my next step, I'm going to try and build snowmobile number two and see how it performs. With this one, once it's built, I recommend that you spin the wheels by hand to make sure that all the gears can spin freely and are connected together. It's like this. You should be able to hear the motor moving when you spin the drive wheel. If so, you can go ahead and see how Snowmobile 2 performs for you. Here's how mine does. That was much faster. Did you test yours? Did it behave the same way? Hmm. Well, let's compare and contrast the two models. What's different between the two? Do you think some of those differences might explain any differences that you saw in performance? You can tell me by commenting in our Facebook private group. You can also post videos of your models in action. I'd love to see what they're doing. What other things you might do? We could change the code, try and make it go at different speeds. Um, can it go backwards? Show me.